covering the week's top tech stories with a slight Linux bias. With the advent of word processors, we saw a great debate take shape. Should you enter a single space or a double space after a period? The double space was a holdover from the days of the typewriter, and even now some people still do it. If you're one of them, you might want to prepare yourself for a certain update that's on the way to Microsoft Word. Microsoft has decided to drop the mic, siding with those who prefer a single space, as test builds of Microsoft Word now treat a double space after a period as a typo. When you allow the word processor to correct the error, it, it'll change it to a single space automatically. According to The Verge, while this feature is only in testing for now, it won't be long before it rolls out to the entire Word using audience on desktop. The good news, however, is that you won't be stuck forever looking at those error lines underneath your double spaces if you don't want to. In a statement to The Verge, Microsoft's partner, Director of Program Management, Kurt Gregerson, said that the double spaces of the world of sorry, the double spaces of the world, the double spacers of the world, will be able to ignore the error flag and continue overusing their space bar if they so choose. Gregerson said, as the crux of the great spacing debate, we know this is a stylistic choice that may not be a preference for all writers, which is why we continue to test with users and enable these suggestions to be easily accepted, ignored, or flat out dismissed. We wanted to know how the free alternative LibreOffice was leaning. In the LibreOffice community forum, user Shankapluza calls two spaces needless extra work, saying if you had to take two breaths for every one, it'd be a tad laboring, no? And designer and typographer Hank C. Mierhoff says, in any part of the European mainland, mainland, it was never done or abandoned over 50 years ago. Double spaces will come back to bite you in some form. As it turns out, LibreOffice already defaults to to change double spaces into single spaces and has for the past several versions at least. Though as Pierre Yev Samian points out, it can be changed in the Tools, Autocorrect, Autocorrect Options menu on the Options tab by checking on Ignore Double Spaces. So there you have it. Microsoft isn't quite pushing out the double spaces yet, but they're following LibreOffice's lead and it feels like a big win for the single spacers. Expect to see this feature land in Microsoft Word in the months ahead.